Oh, Parker's glad you're home, honey. Yay, Parker. He's just so, he's just happy that we're home. I'm still in California time and I slept in. I'm out, I'll see you later, I'm gonna work. Mm. All right, baby. Hey, good morning, guys. It is Monday, June 30th. I'm still in LA time. It's in Kentucky. It's 11.38 and I'm just now leaving, going to the office. I gotta make a list. Got the tire, remember I got the tires rotated now. I gotta get the oil change. I have not done that yet. Uh, gotta create a podcast channel. Everyone was wanting to see. A lot of people don't want to listen to uh, WTFKRadio.com, uh, but they want to see it. So we're going to start uploading the podcast uh, to its own channel. A lot of you guys have recommended that. Yeah, that's a great idea. Uh, I have to figure out what my next prank is. Oh, jeez. It's just so much catching up to do. So hopefully I'll get a prank shot tomorrow of some sort. So, all righty. So uh, it, it is good to be home. But uh, and congratulations to the winner of the vlog yesterday. That was a that was a good answer. What was it? Why? Uh, what did the chicken say to the turkey? It sucks to be you on Thanksgiving. That's why Kenzie picked as the winner. So yeah. So you guys have been uh, bugging us to do a WTFK Radio YouTube channel. Yeah, look what we just did. We're uploading artwork, and now we are uploading. What is it? It's this uh, YouTube. It's a WTFK. What's our What's our YouTube channel? WTFK Radio. WTFK Radio. So there you go. We are going to upload this, and this will be up tomorrow. I'll link to it at the end of this podcast. Check out here the bottom. Of the <laughs> I can't tell you how happy I am to be back in my office. I'm just so. Oh, this is coming on. I just uh, and I got the podcast channel up, uh, WTFK Radio on YouTube. So yeah, like I said, I'm gonna put a link up. So here's what's going to happen, man. This is every room in my office is going to be dedicated to a YouTube channel. We'll have Made in America. We'll have Edit Suites. Uh, this room's going to be a huge think tank. This is going to be a creative compound. This uh, big bright orange room here. Huh. We're going to calm this all down with some foams on the wall and whatnot. This is going to be a little Edit Suite. So I'm excited, man. Things are starting to come together. I mean, I work. When I'm not working, I'm busy trying to find work. So, but you gotta, re you gotta remember too, that a lot of people work so much, they run out of fuel. But, the, but here's the deal. The more you stop for fuel, the further you'll go. So, no tip, no life lesson. If you're working, 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 working your ass off, man, you know, and actually getting things accomplished, give yourself a break, reward yourself. The more you stop for fuel, the further you'll go. So look, you guys know how I hate when people comment about my children and poke fun at them or what and those guys their special needs themselves or they're Satan worshipers or what Satan worshipers. And I just get an email from a guy who says, I understand that uh, this may be of interest of you. I own thomasmabe.com. And so I emailed the guy, so are you are you a Thomas Mabe? He said, I don't see how that matters. Well here's why that matters. That is called squatting. That's intellectual property. If I wanted to go after that, I could get that back. This Yahoo does, is such a lazy ass that he's trying to sell me my domain name, Thomas Mabe. I got TomMabe.com on it for, for like 1500 bucks. Well, look here, you idiot. Won't you go get off your freaking ass, get a job that doesn't entail you screwing people and blackmailing people. Quit, you know, you know someone I remember uh, back when I was working in the country music industry in Nashville, someone uh, bought GarthBrooks.com and they bought all these and tried to sell it to them. But, Went to court, made them pay. It's called squatting. Made them pay for all Garth's legal fees and whatnot. So I just told this guy, I said, look, you know, he said, why does it matter? It matters because if you're squatting on someone's name and hopes to sell it to a Thomas Mabe, that's illegal. I've taken many squatters to court after they try to sell me my own intellectual property and I've always won. So what I do, anyway. Plus the karma gods gave them ass cancer. I suspect this is what you're trying to do now. This is the first email, but I'm going to uh, I'm going to let you keep the name and the ask cancer. So, geez, Louise, look, look. If you want if you want to make an honest living, go out and work your ass off. Do not do do not be a con artist or a scammer. You know, freaking. You know, that is a that is such a freaking cowardly thing to do. Go dig a ditch. Go deliver a pizza. 
So hey man, I just buy some of these and try to sell it to them. Yeah, dick, that ain't gonna happen. Sorry kids, but I have zero tolerance for people who wanna get a free ride through life. That happens all the time. I had a buddy who rented, had rented apartments and chick came rent his apartment Right when she uh, got into it a week later, oh, I lost my job. It took him a six, took him six months to get. He, she knew what she was doing. She had a history of going to these renting apartments from people and living legally for six months because you can't kick them out. And, and they looked back and she had done that multiple times. You know what it costs? Like if I rented, I, I own my building here. But if I rented this room out, if I rent it out to someone, I still got to pay the mortgage. So you are stealing from me. Therefore, you will get ass cancer by the karma gods. Do not be evil. Here's what I teach my kids. Don't steal. Don't be evil. Just don't do it. If you're doing something and it sounds crooked and doesn't sound right, it's not right. So, anyway, any, hopefully fans that I have are fans because we believe in morals. And I just, golly, having a tough day trying to get my groove on. First day back in the office and I get this... Idiot trying to sell me thomasmabe.com. Well, listen here, dude. You keep the name and you keep the ass cancer. A little gift from me and the karma gods. What are you doing, Kenzie? Stop. Oh, I guess. Yeah, we're going to put the smile more in my door there. You remember? Well, all the people in California, hey, we saw your apartment. This is not my apartment. This is my office. Yeah. Didn't one time Roman bring a bunch of small more stickers and we're going to put them all over your I think it is, yeah. I'll be holding you tight. I've been full lonely days in the brown L.A. haze. I can't wait for you to back by my side. Love Jimmy. <laughs> hey! Twins. So, Melanie's got Mackenzie. They're walking through the office. A lot of people wonder, hey Tom, what goes on after hours at the office? So we, we do the piggyback ride stuff. So this orange room has got to go. It's got to go. Should we paint it? I don't think we'll ever paint it. I think we gotta put some black wall over here, curtains here, down. tone it down with, with product. Have you ever decided to do like a chalk wall? Uh-huh. You know what I like it? I do really, 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 really like those. Uh, now I really want this to be my edit suite. It's small, so I won't take up too much space. I like the color. Yeah. I say leave it. It's gonna be a pain in the butt to paint over. Someone got some paint on the ceiling. Yeah. So I am sitting here watching the wonderful podcast, uh, WTFK Radio. It's, uh, we got we opened a podcast YouTube channel. You know I don't like though um, my Michael. gut. Is there a personal a massager that's been made out it's of cheese? This is not a personal story, by the way. This is a story I've taken from <laughs> from the friend. news. This is not this is not about me. It's not got my, a stomach. my sex cheese. No. This really made my day. Okay, well, Leon. 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 The, 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 the two old guys, so you can tell you know. Uh, I got a big surprise on Twitter yesterday. Uh, Tom Mabe, <laughs> the Godfather of pranks. The Godfather of pranks. The singer, the songwriter. Nice. Almost the god of comedy, maybe. To me, uh, befriended me on Twitter. How do you like them beans? Tom, Tom Mabe. That's right, Tom. Tom, thank you, man. Thank you. You made my day. The best. You're the best. And, uh, you know, I watch his vlogs all the time. Uh, he's getting better and better at it. I'm not getting better at it. I'm trying. You know what I'm saying? I'm trying to get subscribers. I'm trying to get the works, you know. But, hey, some people got it. Some people don't. He's been in the business for longer than I have. I'm just a retired old guy, you know. So there you go. Go, go, go subscribe to this guy. This guy is genuinely a, a good guy. He says kind of things about my kids, the family. Subscribe to my Twitter. I wish you could subscribe here. The Two Old Guys Show. You know, I could use the hit. Much love to you and your beautiful family. I adore them. You know, your little dogs. Uh, <laughs> guys, uh, sorry for the, uh, the just... 
the uh, vlog and getting on my soapbox. I just have zero tolerance for the patent trolls and just people trying to capitalize. I love you. I will uh, see you tomorrow. Thanks. Bye. Hey, brother, you want to the bus, get, sir? Hey, man, I got a... 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 Hey, man, I got a...